The automatic waste collection system used in the Kalasatama area collects mixed waste, plastic packaging, bio-waste, cardboard and paper. Other reusable waste is taken to designated sorting rooms. Effective recycling begins in your home. As you sort the waste, you decide. Here at Kalasataman Imu, we want to make this process as nice, efficient and easy as possible for you. In your home, take into account the different kinds of waste collected using the pipeline-based system and set up a sorting system that works for you. Make sure you don't pack the bag for mixed waste too full, but leave enough room so that you can still tie it properly together. Rinse or wipe empty plastic packages if necessary. Odor-free is clean enough. Caps, lids and plastic pumps should be kept separate. Put the plastic packages in a plastic bag. Don't cram the bag too full. A good rule of thumb is to leave a third of the bag empty. Be sure to close the bag carefully. Put only solid bio-waste with the bio-waste. That way you keep your own bio-waste container tidy and the drier the bio-waste, the better the system works. Bio-waste should always be placed in a bag specially designated for bio-waste. Be sure to close the bag carefully. Remember to rinse and drain liquid containers and other cardboard packages containing leftover scraps of food. The packages fit nicely if you first flatten them and then place them inside another empty package. Paper needs to be loose when you bring it to the inlet point for recycling. To avoid blocking the tube, don't bind papers together. You will need your own electronic key to open the inlet point hatch. If the signal lamp is red, use another hatch for the same type of waste, if possible. Throw papers in loose, without a bag, and in small bundles at a time. Large cardboard packages, such as for example pizza boxes and cardboard wrappings for beer multipacks, should be torn apart into smaller pieces first, so that they don't block the inlet of the transportation pipe network. Remember to also recycle the waste bag you brought the waste in. Close the hatch carefully. For security reasons, the system cannot empty the collection point if the hatch has been left open. Any long or large items cannot be placed in the system as they may block it. Take larger cardboard and board items to the sorting room and remember to flatten the cardboard boxes. Remember to also sort your other waste. To the sorting room you can bring metal and glass as well as large waste items and brown cardboard that don't fit in the tube. Find your nearest sorting room here, galasatamanimu.fi. Please note that electric and electronic devices, furniture and dangerous waste do not belong in the sorting room. Once you have sorted the waste correctly and dropped it into the designated inlet hatch at the inlet point, the inlets will be automatically emptied and the waste transported to the collection station via an underground pipe system. Trucks then pick up the waste, compact it into containers from the collection station and transport them to facility for waste recycling such as energy recovery or raw material for new products. Once the waste has passed through IMU, it goes to be recycled. More information about how the waste is processed further can be found on hsy.fi. Let's put Kalasataman IMU to work!